sometimes you have to evolve and let the chips fall where they may. Calling the Origin 12 an AK style shotgun would be like saying that a Ferrari is just another car. While this thing is called the Origin, it should be called the Evolution because its ergonomics and controls are light years ahead of any other AK style shotgun or any other shotgun for that matter. You could also call it the conclusion because I'm not so sure that you could ever make a tactical shotgun any better than this. With so many of these next generation shotguns, you have to give people shooting them for the first time a little class on how to make them work. Go over the controls and tell them that if they don't do all of that while holding their mouth just right, they won't work. Not the case with the Origin, it's so nice having a shotgun do exactly what you expect it to do. Just insert the mag, charge the weapon, and pull the trigger. Literally anyone can run this. A couple of the first things that amazed me is while this does resemble an AK, the magazine's direct insert just like an AR. No need to rock and lock here. Fostec took it one step further and made the bolt hold open on the last round. I love these two features combined and this pretty much sold me on the gun as soon as I found out about it. At least for me this makes it so much more functional and greatly speeds up reloads. Let's take a look at the controls. Everything can be controlled with your trigger finger. The magazine can be dropped with this little tab inside the trigger guard and if you so choose, it also has a switch on the other side of the gun as well. The bolt release is just above that and is nice and oversized. So with just a little practice, when you run dry, you can quickly and easily drop the magazine, slam a new one right in, drop the bolt, and you're right back to blowing the heads off zombies or busting clays or whatever. The Origin 12 also has an ambi safety that is oversized and very easy to actuate from either side of the gun. I just can't say enough about how excellent the controls are on this gun, at least in my opinion, it is so far beyond anything else available today. The next thing to consider with the Origin 12 is its unmatched reliability. So many times as shotguns get more tactical and wilder in design, they get less and less reliable and more finicky about what ammo they will or won't run. Not a concern with the Origin 12. The Origin 12 will run anything that you feed it, from high brass to low brass, buck, slugs, even cheap Walmart loads. This thing will eat it up and just ask for more. And it has no problem running those Walmart loads all day long, day after day. Trust me, we did it over and over again. All right, I'm gonna do a little demonstration here with the Fostec Origin 12. Got some, got a 10 round magazine here. I'm gonna load uh, two bird shot. And then we got uh, some buck shot here. I'm gonna load a couple buck. And then we got some uh, slugs. Fancy. Load a couple slugs up here. And then we're gonna top it off with a couple more bird. Semi-automatic gun, swapping between different types of ammunition like that is usually a pretty hard, hard thing for it. Let's we'll see how the Origin 12 fares. No problem.
Now what I did there isn't recommended, but it's so nice to know that the Origin is capable of running a mixed bag in that way. The Origin 12 features an amazing, infinitely adjustable gas system that should really be tailored to the rounds that you are currently shooting. It's extremely easy to use this gas plug in the front to adjust how much gas the system will vent out. If you're shooting lightweight birdshot, you probably want it closed or just barely open. If you're shooting buckshot, open it a little bit more. Slugs, open it a bit more than that. Boztech recommends that you adjust the gas system until the shells are ejecting about five feet away from the shooter. If the shells aren't being extracted, the gas system probably needs to be closed a bit more. And if it's ejecting the shells a block away and the gun's kicking like a mule, you probably need to open the gas plug up a bit more. Another really smart touch is that you can use a shotgun shell as a wrench to adjust the gas system if it gets too hot or gummed up. Very smart and great attention to detail. What is really cool about this system is it also lets you tune the recoil. When you get just enough gas running through the system to cycle the gun, the recoil on the Origin 12 is extremely mild. Also with the gas venting up, it helps with muzzle rise and leads to quicker follow-up shots. Another thing in the design to notice that helps with recoil is the barrel actually sits below the stock. This gives the gun lower bore access and greatly reduces felt recoil to the shooter. Another very nice touch. This thing is so much fun to shoot that I kind of lost track of how many rounds we ran through it, but it's probably approaching 2000. And I can honestly say the only malfunctions that we had were when we were tuning the gas system, and that really doesn't count against reliability. The Origin 12 is unbelievably reliable. In all honesty, I've seen pump shotguns malfunction more than the Origin does. Lots of talk on the interwebs that the Origin 12 is the fastest cycling shotgun in the world, and I can't argue with that. I know it runs faster than I can run a shotgun. You can try to outrun the bolt, but I haven't been able to do it. I know that this thing will spit shells as fast as you can pull the trigger and just asks for more. Another thing that is neat about the Origin 12 is its disassembly method allows it to be a takedown shotgun and fit into a very small case. In fact, it ships in a relatively small Pelican case that will have you scratching your head. You'll be amazed that a full-size shotgun can fit in that case, but once you understand how it works, you'll realize that it could actually fit into a case much smaller than that one. This also gives the shotgun quick change barrel capabilities, so if you decided to make a short barrel shotgun out of it, you could quickly and easily swap between your short barrel and long barrel configurations. Something I'm going to be interested in looking into because the short barrel only comes out as far as the gas plug and how cool would that be? The Origin 12 comes in three available finishes, all nickel, black with nickel internals, and all black. I got full nickel because I really like the way it looks. But what I also like is with all the internals coated in that nickel Teflon coating, makes the gun have a slick finish on the inside, which not only contributes to the outstanding reliability, but also makes cleaning a cinch as the nickel cleans up very easily. Some other great features of the Origin 12 are the threaded fluted barrel that accepts any Sega muzzle device, and now Fostec is offering a choke tube adapter for the gun.
Another cool accessory that I'm using is the oversized charging handle. I'm still going back and forth a bit on whether I'm going to keep running this or not, but it's nice that Fostec offers it and it does what it's supposed to do, makes charging the weapon easier. The magwell is oversized and slightly flared to help with reloads. The ejection port is huge to give those shells plenty of room to exit. And the charging handle is non-reciprocating, so you don't have to worry about smashing those digits. It comes equipped with really nice diamond head sights and currently is being shipped with ATI furniture. Not that there's anything wrong with the ATI furniture, but I switched mine out to a Mission First Tactical Minimalist stock and an Ergo Grip, because that's the original way that the Origin was equipped, and I just like the look of that more. We have to talk about the magazines for just a second, and they ooze quality craftsmanship just like the rest of the Origin 12. The mags are available in 5, 8, and 10 round sticks, as well as 20 and a 30 round drum. These are beautifully constructed with silky smooth function. I love the little finger grooves on the edges and the Fostec logo etched in the side. They load as smoothly as they unload, and I've never seen a drum function as well as this one does for any platform. And the fact that you can see and touch each round when it's loaded doesn't hurt the cool factor at all. Another little thing to make note of is the trigger is actually really good. A gun with this much going on, you might think that they would overlook the trigger, and in all honesty, I would give them a pass if they did. But this thing has a very crisp pull and breaks at about 4 pounds. So what's it like shooting the Origin 12? I can honestly say that it's the most fun I've ever had shooting a shotgun. The controls are spot on intuitive, the accuracy is really good, and the ergonomics are off the chart. Any downsides? Just one. The price of admission. But you're going to have to pay for perfection. Really, this is one of those guns that is so much more than the sum of its parts. It's much more than an AK or a shotgun. What it is is a new weapon system that borrows a few cues from some older ones, but is far superior to anything else that is available right now. If Elmer Fudd had this shotgun, Bugs Bunny wouldn't have standed a chance. 